video is brought to you today by Ghost Tags. This is my own company that I started because I wanted a glow in the dark air tag case. These things are awesome. You can stick them on your backpack, on your dog's collar, and you will be able to find it at night. We've got two colors, blue and green. They've got great reviews. Go check them out. Links to them down below. Now on to the video. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Slim and you're watching Slimothy TV. In this video, I'm going to do a quick overview of iOS 16.3 developer beta. Now, the latest developer beta came out like over a week ago, and we knew that we were not gonna get another one uh, this past week, simply because of the holidays. So if you got on this beta, you better, uh, you better be sure that it's, it's working, because if you put this on your main device and it's glitchy, Apple's not gonna save you with an update anytime soon. So next week is, this coming week is when we're gonna see the update uh, for the next dev beta. Uh, for right now, honestly, there's no real point to update. The only thing new is the security keys for the most part for your iCloud, which most people don't care about. So that's about it. I have not noticed anything new in here. Uh, so I've been running it. Luckily, there have been zero major glitches. So that is a plus. Uh, the same ones that plague the old iOS are still in this one. Like sometimes if you swipe from your notifications after rebooting the phone, you'll see an old missed notification from like days ago. Very strange, but I've been noticing that. But overall, I mean, it's been super smooth, as smooth as iOS 16.2. So should you update? You can if you want. Uh, there's no major hiccups that I've noticed, uh, but I will note that there's nothing new here either. So the battery life is possibly slightly worse than 16.2, but it's not much worse. Um, this feels just like 16.2. So all those YouTubers making 20 minute videos on all the new features, there's really not any. And if you download this, you're not gonna notice any either. Everything is just the same as it was. Uh, smoothness is about the same as well as 16.2. Like I said, battery life, a little bit worse than 16.2, but very similar. Performance, just about the same. So again, for all you people that are DMing me and asking me, should I upgrade to the beta? There's gonna be a new beta in just a couple days anyway. So if something was wrong with this one, it will be patched very soon, but I haven't noticed anything. So if you wanna update, feel free. Uh, if you're on the beta train, may as well. There's no reason not to. There's just no new features, so it's boring. Uh, and I'm not gonna keep making update videos on a boring OS. So hopefully you like the short format of this one because I don't wanna waste your guys' time. If you like the video, hit the big thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.